we'll get kicked out. <laughs> All right, folks, welcome back to the channel. We're about to go hang out with the fellas and thought we'd start this one off with a cold start. so angry in the morning I'm just going for a little drive <laughs> but hey we're gonna go hang out with the fellas uh, got a few rides we can show you and uh, hope y'all stay tuned <laughs> it's Sunday morning working on Sunday afternoon you know we out doing our thing we're gonna go hook up with some fellas maybe get a reaction video or two and uh, well not a video but a couple people in the seat see what they think old shake and bake <laughs> and uh, you know just go out and have some fun so stay tuned folks I hope y'all like this kind of stuff we're just gonna roll with it all right folks we out here with the big deal in the big frostbite blue and i'll call it a lime green what what, what color is it lime green it works. lime green we it's not most, really a lime it's multiple colors of lime green you know yeah i mean it's close enough it's, it's close, close enough, enough. Yeah. it's close enough all right so i'm gonna put you on the spot man let's go let's go down 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 what you got going on all right we'll start with this start with the inside the blue, the blue guts all right one of the, one of a kind in uh the dmv Look at oh man, he got a little logo up the yes, 392 sir. logo on there. Yeah. Got them back seats done. Yes, indeed. All blue, man. That looks sharp in here. I do like that. He's got the door panels done yes, too. Indeed, That's sir. key. Got the door panels. That's key. Got the uh, armrest. Got the Arm center rest. consoles. Yeah, center, center console console. Done. Even the back center console. Oh man! That's all right, quickie. all right. You went all out. All out. That is sweet. That looks good. Appreciate it. All right, so let's, if you don't mind, what, what was the, the price for the leather and then the price for the install? Leather Seat Pros, $804. $804 for the entire kit. Panels, armrests, center console, everything. Folks, that's, 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 a, that's a good deal because cat skin will charge you more yeah. than that. So you, I don't know if you know it, you can go to your dealership and get cat skin and you can get any color you want, any mix you want, uh, but it's, it's but like they 14. They won't, they won't add the logo because of the trademark. Oh, uh, they won't add, so they won't add the logo. And they're, I think they're like twelve, fourteen hundred dollars yeah, right. That's, that's just, for, just the basic, yeah, just for the leather. I don't think that's with the install. No, no, not, it'd be like $2,500 for the then install. You, then you gotta do the install. Yeah. All right. So what else we got? All right, we have, uh, like I said, all right. We got the install of this. Uh, we got the logos around here. Oh, go ahead. Rock Designs, Wicker Bill. Got the Wicker Bill. Icon Motorsports Diffuser. Icon Motorsports Diffuser. Thermal. I like the 392 on the back too, man. Oh, that's yeah. that's sweet. I haven't Thanks. seen anyone do that yet. Well, I saw somebody on. Uh, I kind of like jocked off my man. I he, got you. He had it, but uh, I like come it, on. so I went with it. Somebody somewhere, right? You know, <laughs> somebody. <laughs> If you're thinking about doing something, I guarantee you somebody somewhere has already done it. Right, right. <laughs> it's already don't, been so done. So don't sue me. Don't sue me. Yeah, no sue me. your style, but I got the full cat back thermal R&D exhaust on here. Okay. So, and next week I have the... Thermal, what did you say? Thermal. Thermal D? Thermal R&D. Thermal R&D. Okay. Full cat back. All right, we'll have to start it up here in a second get a yeah. few revs too. You know the deal. You know the deal. I got I upgraded from those Pirelli's, got my... Mucho Macho Cosmos 315 all the way around. Okay. Add the spikes on here. And uh gotcha. So three three fifteens all around. Three fifteen all the way around. Man, this car is nice. Don't forget. Let's go give him a follow. Big deal 392 folks. Go give him a follow. Let me go ahead and get you a quick all right. start. We got we got the little B here too. Alright, we got the little spike spiky lug nuts too. Check them out. Alright, we're gonna get a little warm start and a couple revs here. This thing does sound good. Right. Keep in mind, 
folks, that's still with the rev limiter. <laughs> you know the deal. These automatics got a real low rev limiter when it comes to uh, to okay. revving out. That was probably what about four grand, four maybe, grand. Yeah, give or take. Yeah. yeah. So uh, keep that in mind when you're listening. All right. So what's the what's the future hold? Well, future holds. Uh, I guess uh, once I get those headers next week. Um, I had no idea after that. Maybe a super pro charger. So headers, high flow cats or regular uh, cat, cats? Regular cats. Regular, regular cats. cats. Mm -hmm. Uh, and those are stainless works you're going for. Stainless works, yep. And I got those for. Uh, he, he's he's going to Mike too, so to get them installed. So if yeah. you need something installed, hit me up. I'll hook you up with Mike, and he'll he'll do you right. Right. He, he, you took care of me. Yeah. Good, good looking out. Good looking out. He, he'll do you right. I'm not even gonna throw the price out there, but good looking Man, out. Man, I'm gonna start putting another fifty hundred dollars on everything I do. I send to him, so I get some commission out of That's this. That's right. <laughs> no, I'm not gonna do that. <laughs> I'm not gonna do that. I promise. All right. So long tube headers, cats are coming soon. Coming next week. And then, then, then what do you think? Maybe you think I'll, you think that's good for now? That's that'll be good for now. That'll be good for yeah, now. Keep the wife off my back, yeah, of course. There you go. There you go. <laughs> yeah. That's it, you know. Yeah. Man, we'll do one more walk around. This thing is sharp. I really do. Uh, if you haven't seen this frostbite blue in person, you need to see this frostbite blue in person. I'm not a big blue person. Uh, but this this really looks sharp. Oh, we forgot the splitter, didn't we? Oh, did the splitter, K and G splitter. K and G splitter up front. Got Scat Pack Road on there. I I, I like what you did with 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 the uh, the logos and stuff. Uh, okay. It's not too much. Oh yeah. It, it's you're like right right there where it's borderline, just barely crossing it, the line. It it looks great. It's not too much. And, and makes the car look really sharp. Thank you. But hey, once again, Big Deal 392, we'll show you again. Big Deal 392, he's only on Instagram, folks. So shoot on over there and give him a follow. I started to bring my uh, All right, folks. GoPro. We're uh, I'm gonna set this in the back so it don't bother me. We're gonna go take Big Deal for a ride in Shake and Bake. Give him, give him the idea of what a Pro Charger kind of feels like. Ready to tell that just taking off is it, but you know what I mean? You you wouldn't know it. If right. you didn't hear it, you wouldn't know right. it. Right. And I'm not I'm not even in boost yet. I'm still in vacuum. Wow. <laughs> we'll get out here, we'll take a quick trip up 50 and okay. and, and, and back. Right. Uh, just to give you an idea, like getting on the highway pool and then coming back on the highway. Like say, if I would have known that you had it, I'd been like so shocked that it <laughs> it's moving like it's moving right now, but we haven't, haven't seen anything yet. Yeah, that's just, you know what I mean? It right. feels like a stock 392, yeah, it does. right? Yeah, exactly. But we all know it's not. <laughs> all right, let's see, get up here. But like I said, if, if you have an even inkling that you're going to want to go more power or E85, just just go for the bigger injectors and then also you're gonna have to upgrade your fuel system okay uh, you're definitely gonna need because I've had a guy running like eight seven eight pounds of boost he was having problems with one 525 uh, fuel pump and that's a that's a big fuel pump that's what I got now is a right. 525 yeah. and he had to move to a dual setup to uh, to make sure he had enough pump to push the E85. And that makes a difference. It makes a huge difference. Because okay. E85, you're gonna use uh, roughly, they say 30% more E85 than you do regular gas. Okay. So it's gotta pump more of that to get, you know, to get you in the in the power band. But it's you know 260 something a gallon. Right? That's what's not bad. Yeah, you just gotta you just gotta kind of be careful and, and check it every now and then wherever you're getting it from. Right. To, uh, to make sure you're in that 70, 75. 70's getting borderline. You want 75 and above. What about uh, your, at uh, least. What about your braking? What, what kind of brakes do you have? So I still got stock brakes. Stock brakes? So for me, I don't have the Brembo's, right? I got right. stock 5.7 brakes. Mm -hmm. I just know what it takes for my car to stop. Right. You know what I mean? So it's not like I'm gonna get right up on somebody and slam on the brakes oh, and no. think I'm gonna stop. Like your Brembo's. Right. right? You could do that with your Brembo's. But uh, as far as brakes, for me, I'm, I'm I'm good. Eventually, I may go, you know, Brembo's or a race type 
uh, brake package, but for me right now, I, I'm, I'm good with the brake power that I got. Right. I know, like I said, I know where to stop and I know when to stop. You good. Yeah. yeah. Matter of fact, I swapped, swapped out the Brembo pads for power stops on the uh, charger. So Brembo is too much brake pads for the Brembo. Yeah, you gotta get new pads. <laughs> yeah, you gotta, get, you gotta get new pads. And I'm gonna get the new rotors. You got the slotted rotors on all the way around, right? Yeah, slotted, drilled and slotted. Drilled and slotted. Yeah. Took my hat off, so I can't hold it to my hand. So. <laughs> internals mm -hmm. I'm gonna go e85 so bigger injectors bigger uh, bigger fuel setup dual pump fuel setup at least and then uh, yeah we'll turn up the boost and and see what this 57 see what the 57 can do so you you just want to race local and once you get everything done you go take it on the road and you know so I go to a, a, a number of the different racing. modern street hemi shootouts right. I'm not really big into the racing scene I don't think I'll get big in the race but I do like doing the modern street heavy shootout great group of guys uh, all the way around right. uh, you know you need help you break something somebody more likely more likely than not depending on what it is right, yeah. if it's nothing big somebody's there's got one yeah. and they'll either help you out and swap it out and you can pay them later or you can pay them there at the track or whatever so you got um, each other's back I yeah like everybody's kind of got you know everybody's back it's uh it's a really, really neat experience. Um, you know, people you just met a couple times. Oh man, I just broke an axle. Oh, hey, I got one. You know, <laughs> yeah. hey, I got one. Not those spare axles. Hey, don't worry, just because most of the guys that go, the, well, the big guys like HHP, Hemi Fever uh, Tuning. Um, who else goes up there? Um, AJ True Street Performance okay. and those guys. Right. They're all. They're all, the, they're all the big dudes. Damn they're deep. yeah, yeah. They're the ones running, you know, sevens or, oh. or they run eighth mile and run, you know, low fours wow. and, and things like that. Yeah. So they're in the race big time. Right. Yeah. But um, yeah, it's just it, it really is the Modern Street Hemi Shootout is a great experience. So there's one coming to uh, uh, MIR this year. Okay. And they do MIR pretty much every year. Uh, if you get a chance, you need you need to hit a Modern Street Hemi Shootout. I would love to, but like I said, these weekends, I work the weekend, so I 
I'm pretty much strapped. But right. if I make a make a break to get a weekend, I definitely and hopefully the weather's right the day I take off. Oh yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. That's that's pretty much. Uh, and then pretty much everything else I hit is kind of test and tune. Okay. And then I just try and find someone to line up a somewhat competitive race. But racing right. is getting kind of big now, especially these cars. Yeah, it's. Problem is, there's a lot of tracks closing. So, you know, everyone's wondering, hey, why is the street racing scene getting so big? Uh, yeah, yeah. Because all of the tracks are going, like, Capital, right here in mm -hmm. Crawford. Right. They closed last year. It looks like they're, they're reopening. Thing to bring with me my cooler right. my tent yeah. our tires right. the jack because i changed uh, i'm going back to changing my tires at the track because i noticed driving to the track my mickey thompson was wearing out pretty quick mm -hmm. so uh, for those of you guys that are looking for you know mickey thompson's and want to drive into the track i suggest It's not. It's not snap your neck. No, but it's but it's you know it's right. there. You yeah, know what I mean? Yeah. If, if you're not ready, you will bite your tongue for sure. And, and I've seen a couple people on, especially I don't know if you follow B Mason on on YouTube too. No. He's a big Hemi guy. Okay. 
and you know it's it's all in where you want to spend your money right, right? if you want to feel that hellcat snap your neck power get a positive displacement if uh you know you want that smooth in power where it's not so you know not so hellcat ish right get you a pro charger or a vortex or i say pro charger right. but <laughs> well, you, love, you love your setup i i do love my setup and I'm quite sure you researched it, yeah. you broke everything down, and said, boom, that's what I well, want. Well, I knew I had to go with some kind of tri centrifugal force uh, supercharger because uh -huh, of the shaker. Right. Yeah. I do think uh, Magnuson, between Magnuson and Steve White Motors, I think there is a kit for a positive displacement to fit up underneath the shaker. But uh, I, I pretty much knew I had to go with something centrifugal. Centri centri <laughs> I can't say that word enough. So but, what, is, uh, what is that what I'm hearing right now while we're idling? So you're hearing a little chirp, 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 yeah, chirp, chirp. Yeah. That's the Pro Charger. Okay. And so that's the difference too, is you're going to get, when you're idling, you're going to get, you know, that, because it's running off the belt. Right, okay. Right? Yeah. So you're going to hear that as it as it's running, you're going to hear the chirp, little, chirp, okay. chirp, chirp. So you are yeah. canned? I am canned. You are canned, okay. Yep. So you get that lope, 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 that's the okay. That's the lope, right. yep. And, love it, man, and, love it. So my buddy, wide body Mopar Mike, right? Uh, mm -hmm. I hadn't hadn't said this yet. Ran nine. He's got a scat pack. Ran nine nine three this weekend. I think I saw that footage yesterday. On a stock, uh, stock transmission. Mm. Now he, now he's having a little problems with it now, <laughs> of course. <laughs> but uh, you know the eight the eight HP the seventy right. will, will will take a lot. Mm. But a nine, though, that's, that's moving, yeah, man. He was putting uh, 933 to the wheels. Woo! What are you putting to but the wheels? He put, he put a lot into his car. What are you putting to the wheels? So right now I put a right around 630 okay. on on race gas to the wheels. So in a in a track setup, running race gas, 630 and some change. Okay. And he's still moving too, though. <laughs> But nine at the wheel, that is crazy. I know. Yeah, yeah. But like I said, he's done he's done a lot of work to his. Uh, so he's going to go uh, get his trans built within the next couple weeks, and then uh, eventually he's going to go with a with a bigger pro charger <laughs> and really crank up the boost. And, like uh, fifteen hundred to the wheel. Yeah, yeah. Well, I don't know if he'll get that far. <laughs> The, uh, hey, and he's on the stock bottom end. For a daily, man, this thing. Is, hey, no wonder you smile. Yeah, I smile every. I oh, smile yeah. all the time. Every time I start shaking big up, man, I'm smiling. Mm -hmm. So you know, it makes makes it all worth it in right. the end. Yeah. I survived shaking big. <laughs> <laughs> I need to get a, I need to get a t-shirt with that on it now. Yeah. I, I survived shaking. Bait. I survived shaking big. There we go, folks. Hey, we're going to wrap it up. That's going to do it for this one. If you're stopping in for the first time, please check out the rest of the channel. If you like what's going on, do me those few things. Like, subscribe, smash that bell, shoot me a comment, and share on your social media. Definitely appreciate it. Until next time, folks, adios. Thanks, big deal. No problem. <laughs>